couldn't get worse, could it? So welcome back to more Blood Moon, and I hope you lads are doing well. So when we left off, we got these traveler fellas and we brought them to Ravenrock. So my hope this episode build Ravenrock. And uh, yeah, that's kind of my hope, because if we don't build Ravenrock, we have no supplies and nothing to get us forward. Last episode we did get some better armor and a better sword which I'm absolutely happy with. We're doing a lot better than what we were before and would you look at that we're almost level 4. That I'm delighted with. There was also a few comments in the last episode and there were some good ones telling me about good items and strong stuff to get and I think just for the moment I, I just kind of want to see if I run into stuff and kind of find it on my own for the time being but if we do start to struggle I will absolutely go and get those better items if we need to so if i'm struggling we'll go and get the good stuff is that fair i like the surprise of just coming across something good but yeah that's what we're gonna do going forward but you we're talking to you so carnius talked you into joining this little venture did he he has unique dialogue very well i'm managing the site i have an assignment for you so he wants me to find some ebony ore uh, okay, we need to find some ebony ore, I guess. Where am I going to find that? Do you guys know where ebony ore is? You betrayed the clan. Couple strips of What's your back? back? I haven't betrayed anyone. What clan? I've literally never done anything. Okay, goodbye. Where am I going to find ebony ore? If it's around clo- oh, <laughs> it's right in front of me the moment I say that. Okay, we need- how many pieces do we need? Uh, four more. Okay, there's none here. That's good. There's two pieces here. We are already halfway there. There's one piece. Okay, we're almost done the quest. I thought this was going to be hard. Four pieces. Back we go. I kind of like how our character looks. Everything is just kind of mashed together, but he looks well. I like his bear hat. We're probably going to keep the bear hat for like the whole thing. For like the whole series. I, I just like it. Falco, here's the deal. You could have just walked over and picked it. It's right there. I'm looking right at the ebony. You could have just picked it up. I mean, I know fetch quests and everything, and I know it's a game, but like... It's right there. Here's your ore. I'll have to take it back to Carnius. I have to run all the way back. There's more to this quest than leads on. And since we're carrying a lot of ebony, I run really slow. You don't know, feeling good about this episode. We have some good swords and equipment, so we're gonna do better. I I hope. Killing wolves in two hits. It's pretty much all the series is, is just killing wolves at this stage. I do kind of like the whole Nordic team of uh, Blood Moon. Which makes sense because I think in this in this game, uh, Solstheim is owned by Skyrim, and during Skyrim, which is set in the future, Solstheim is owned by Morrowind. So it's a interesting mix. I think the lore there is like a what is it? The mountain in Morrowind erupted and ruined most of the close by towns. This Skyrim council felt bad and people needed to go elsewhere, so they gave him Solstheim. I mean, that's kind of the textbook version of it. I think I'm not very well versed, but that was nice of them. Here we are, back to Carnius. Here's your rocks. He couldn't even accomplish that by himself, could he? He's on my side. Yeah, the ore was just right in front of him and he couldn't have just brought it back. Come back and see me in about three days. By then, the construction should be underway. So he said to wait three days. So I guess I'm going to wait three days. Because I have nothing else to do here. Hello. I personally don't have anything for you, but Falco does. Go and see what's going on. Now we have to run back. We are just a little errand boy, aren't we? Now it's just back to Raven Rock we go. It's a foggy morning here in Solstheim. It's like Silent Hill. I think everyone always says that whenever there's fog. Would you look at that? There's some buildings. That looks nice. Oh, and there's stuff here as well. That's really cool. I've never like done this quest before. This is like really interesting. My man Falco. Anything else for me? So this Nord has arrived and he's causing problems because he doesn't want the people building on his land. Which I can kind of understand because, you know, it's the Imperial Legion kind of enforcing themselves on the Solstheim. So, you know. So we need to convince him to leave. Okay. I have plenty of gold to tell him to go away. Hello, my man. You need to go. Whoa, that's some heavy language. So he doesn't want to talk, apparently. So I need to rough him up with my fists. Okay, I don't have like any hand-to-hand -hand skill and this guy has just told me to deal with it and just get used to it. Okay, but my hand-to-hand -hand is five. Does he expect me to go practice on wolves? So I guess I need to train my hand-to-hand -hand skill. Is there any training on this island? Do I just practice on wolves? I guess I have to practice on wolves. This is going to be a challenge. Okay, come here you. This is going to take a while. Yeah, not going well. I haven't gotten a single punch yet. I got a punch in. Okay, this is taking too long. Okay, I've been here a while and we still haven't gotten a punch in. Okay, you know what? 
this is just, I'm just wasting my time. Okay, so I need to go check up if there's a trainer or anything on this island that I can level up my hand-to-hand -hand for. Okay, so nobody on this island trains hand-to-hand. -hand. Is that what you're telling me? Okay, I don't know what to do. Here's the deal. I made a rule for myself to not visit the mainland, but if this is the case, I need uh, I need hand-to-hand -hand skill. Like, I'm not going to take down that nor There's no point in trying. Like, I don't want to kill him, but do we have to kill him? I think we might have to kill him. Does anything happen if I just attack him? I just want to put off going to the mainland because I just don't want to ruin the sanctity of the challenge. I mean, to be fair, Carnius just wanted him dead, so we'll see. I'll go over and kill him, and if we fail the quest, then I'll have to reload. And if I fail the quest, then I guess I'm leveling up my hand on wolves, because that's the only alternative I can think of. I'm not even sorry. Uh, he just disappeared? What? His body disappeared in a strange flash of light. Okay, I have incurred the wrath of the gods. He's dead. I mean, he's upset with me that we killed him, but he doesn't really care. So I need to go back to our man over here. Listen, I was not going to go and train my hand-to-hand -hand for hours for nothing. That's just annoying and stupid. Come here, wolf. Hello, mage. Oh, I can level up. If I can, if I can get off the ground. Get up, just get up, just get up, just get up. Okay, she's killing me straight away. Oh, you're alive again. Oops. Did you just sneeze on me? It's 2020, you can't be doing that. So yeah, screw you. Okay, that mage is right there, but we can chance her again. If I can just knock her down. There we go. If we knock her down, we can kill her easily. Look at these boots. Armor rating of 105. Those boots. Are mine. Armor rating has gone from 30 to 38. There's another mage woman. We should be killing as many as we can. They drop good stuff. More daggers. Endurance. I'll sell the armor back in town because I'm going that way anyway. Have I ever been inside this shrine before? Or this cave? I'm gonna check this cave. So have I been here? Have I been here before? I don't think so. And I can level up. Oh, it's a Draugr. Oh, he knocked me down straight away. Come on. We're doing decent damage to him. Down he goes. They have nothing on them. I'm going to rest. And five points of strength. Two points of endurance. Two points of agility. Now we're in a lot better shape. Here's more Draugr. He's doing good damage to me as well. Come on. Okay, we got him down. He has Grave Terror. Uh, okay. Anything interesting here? Anything at all. There's nothing but this ice and I need tools to break it. Okay, there's nothing in here. At least we know now we can kill Draugrs, I guess. Let's just run back to Ravenrock. It's a naked man. Aren't you cold? Well, he's an ord, so I guess he isn't cold. Take his armor for the gold. Doesn't this DLC also have like werewolves? When can I encounter a werewolf? I want to be a werewolf. A werewolf will probably give us an edge over combat. In Morrowind, you want to jump everywhere to get your acrobatics up. It's just rules. It's the same in Oblivion. You just jump everywhere. You, my man. Take all my stuff. 700 gold. I'll take it. Now, on to Carius, the man himself. Wait, I'm, I'm in the wrong building. Don't mind me. Way hey, up she rises. Way hey, up she rises. You, my best friend. Who cares about Nord crackpots? We've got a lot to do here. You do realize I'm a Nord also. He's dead? Wonderful. That'll send a message. He just gave me a thousand gold. That's fantastic. How much gold do we have now? Almost 3,500 gold. That's brilliant. I'm happy with that. So I guess it's back to Falco. What kind of a name is Falco anyway? It's cool, but I mean, just, just, you know. It wouldn't be a journey back without some wolves. I hope now they just give me a fun quest, you know, l let me kill some things, go into a dungeon or something, not just pointless back and forth, I'm getting sick of this now already. Falco is probably not a fan of me right now. I have nothing for you. Wait, if you have nothing for me, what do I do? Do I just wait another three days? I'm just gonna wait, I guess. And my journal is updated. First phase of construction is complete. Does that mean we have shops? Do we have shops? Are you shops? Please be a shop. Please have stuff. Merchants? Anything? Storehouse? Storehouse has jugs. I'll take resource speed. Okay, please have something. Here's just a locked house. Uh, okay, okay. That's a... This is a big, like, tree house. I don't know. <laughs> what is up here? There's just a table and a carpet. It's a nice carpet. But, uh, yeah, it doesn't do much. Are you a shop? It's not a shop, but it's a house I can go into. Stop building houses. Build shops. We need money. Here's Gadar's house. This is a big fancy place. It's very green inside, though, I must say. And I can use his bed. I mean, I did help build this town. I ran back and forth twice, so I'm doing a lot of hard work. But yeah, not much else here. Okay, it doesn't look like there's shops here. That's a pain. Here's a mine. This mine is definitely going to be a dungeon in itself. I can just guarantee that. Give me a quest. Roldar is gone. 
but we have other problems. Yeah, that was days ago. Just move on. I have nothing for it. Do I have to go back to Carnius? Oh, I have to run back to your man. Oh, okay. If I run back to Carnius and he tells me to come back here to Falco, I'll snap. Mages and wolves. All it is is just mages and wolves. <laughs> Her stuff is good. And she has lockpicks. Very good. Right, what is this? Is this the third or fourth time I've ran back here? I think it's the third, but it's it's still a pain. I could really do with the boots of blinding speed. Here we are again. I'm sick of this town. I'm sick of this building. I'm sick of this stairway. What is that, a plant? It looks ugly. Take it down. I don't like it. I need to get a shipping manifest from Falco. So I need to run back to Raven Rock. I'm just going to drop and save and uh, one second. I'm just going to... I've been expelled from the company. I, I just wanted to do that. I really... I just needed to get that out of my system. Uh, running back to Raven Rock. I would have loved to have been at Bethesda when this quest was being thought of. They're just sitting in a boardroom thinking, you know what would be a great idea? If we have them run back and forth between the same two settlements constantly, just for small menial tasks. I think the players would really enjoy that. If I see one more wolf, I swear, I am just leaving a trail of dead wolves wherever I go and dead mages. It's to teach the island not to mess with me. Now, if I take this shipping manifest, is he just gonna make me bring the manifest back? You, talk to me. It's not one thing. Don't you dare walk away from me. So they haven't even built a dock, so there's no ship coming in. Okay, so I need to ask around, ask the workers. Seen anything? What? No, I don't know anything about a ship. Do I have to persuade you or... Oh, I'm not giving you gold if I don't need to. Can I ask you? What? No, no sign of a ship? Okay, so no one knows anything. I might have to persuade him, I think. You seen anything? I saw a light to the northwest. So he saw a light. Do I say this to Falco? Do I need to go swim offshore and find a ship? Falco has asked me to head northwest and look for the supply ship. North, south, east, west. So it should be in this direction. Okay, if I have to look for a ship in the ocean, I'm going to wait for a bright day. I can't have fog, otherwise I won't be able to see anything. There we go. Now it's a nice bright day and I can actually see fair. Can't see any ship at this part. I guess it's more northwest. I guess it's just further up this way. What is that? Okay, there's some brown bears and stuff around. I can't, I can't attack them. I can't aggro them or they'll destroy me. Just gonna swim around so we can avoid them. There's a nice little enclosure here. I'm gonna take a look inside. Mumbling's dwelling. Hello, Mumbling. Okay, so he wants me to rescue his friend. I'm a little busy right now, so I might do it next episode, maybe, if I remember it. Where did the snow come from? Now I can't see in front of me at all. And there's a bear. Get away from him. Like, I can't see two feet ahead of me. Still can't see. It's been two days and it's still going. Okay, there we go. Uh-oh. I can kill the wolves, but not the bears. Oh, but the ship is just right here. Okay. I did not see that before. There's Draugr outside. Two Draugr might be a problem. Oh, don't get knocked down. I was gonna kill that other guy and then heal, but if I can just get this guy to run over here and not aggro the other fella. He's knocking me down, not good. And yeah, we just took him down easily. Well, not easily, but we took him down. I'm gonna go over here to rest, just so I have full everything. What was that? Oh, it's a Dark Brother assassin. I'm just gonna leave his body here. I don't care about assassins. Okay, there's two more following me. I can kill this guy first. Oh, just hit him, just hit him. Okay, we got him down. Now I'm gonna heal if I can. Oh, please heal, come on. Okay, just need to kill this guy. Come on, please kill him, please kill him. Oh god, okay, this is difficult. I need to aggro one at a time if I can, because I need full fatigue dealing with these guys. Okay, we aggroed one. Get over here, buddy. He's such a weird run. Oh, he's knocked me down. We killed him. Okay, I've just been attacked by two. Oh my god, just leave me alone. An assassin and a wolf want to kill me. Okay, and I'm dead. Oh, why? I just want to rest. Okay, now I want to this Draugr. Man, this quest is a pain. Probably because I'm level four. Kind of the point. Knock me down instantly. Now can I investigate? I have found the supply ship. Does that mean I can go back? Or do I have to let them know that the ship is here? Or do I have to go into the ship and see what happened? I think I have to go in. He has potions, but it's just cure common disease. Oh, here's a woman. Did you take this guy out yourself? If you did, fair play. So we need to bring this woman back to Raven Rock. Follow me and keep away from the bears. Thankfully, she's right behind me. Morrowind escort quests can be a real pain if they get lost. There's a major front. I'm gonna wait. And now we attack her. She took a while to take down. Give me your helmet and your boots so I can sell it. A wolf cures. It's light armor, so it's no use to us, but it's worth a lot. Follow me. Come on, your highness. What wants to kill me? Oh, it's just a basic wolf. 
says the person who didn't even attack it. Finally, back here. Come on now. Almost there. I don't know why I'm bringing her to a town that's barely built, but look. If he tells me to bring this girl back to the fort, I'll, I'll go insane. I'll snap. Here's the assignment. Okay. So, I think he wants us to go back to Carnius. So, we'll, we'll do that in the next episode. Uh, he also says that we can give him pickaxes if I can find any and he'll pay me for them. So, I don't know if that's like a quest or an optional thing. If it's a quest, uh, I'll do it. We got some things done. We killed a few draggers. We went back and forth a couple of times. We got some slightly better equipment. So, hey, a bit, bit of a dull one overall but hey look we got it done it's out of the way hopefully the next couple of quests are a bit more exciting so yeah other than that if you enjoyed leave a like subscribe and all that and i'll talk to you in the next one cheers lads